Hello everyone, I'm Raphael Perry and it's time for some more Dead in Vinland. A game that is now running for longer than I thought it would. And you know what? Yeah, I'm getting my money's worth out of this one. I'm quite enjoying it. So, sometime this day, that scheming scumbag is going to come demanding we get lots and lots and lots of wood and hand it over to him. So we got lots of wood. He is going to demand our wood stock and it won't be very musical. But let's see what we can do. So. Moira, how bad? Sickness is bad. But we have a food shortage, so Moira's gonna have to go on fruit gathering all day because it's the most reliable way in which we can build up our food supplies. Now, Brother Angelico was suffering from a nasty snake bite injury, but his sickness and injury levels are significantly lower now. I think we can send him back to work on something. And he is good at what? Um, oh, not a lot to be honest. Maybe chopping wood or working in the garden. Yeah, let's have him... Oh, that's harvesting, that's harvesting. Not gardening? Okay. Let's just try to gather up some more healing plants, because we're running a little low on them. Right. Kari can keep working on water. Eric can hopefully finish this off now. Does the workshop need? Yes, it does. It needs repairing. There we go. That was lots of repairs. And now who's left? Are you still having a break? You're still having a break. Right. Sorry, we can't have that. We need plenty more stone from a mine and iron. Actually. No, 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 no. Right. No focus. Let's try get a bit of both. Okay, that's our morning plans in order. And let's hope we get that fire upgrade done by lunchtime. Eric will be working on that right now and does indeed complete it. We now have better knowledge of how to burn firewood more efficiently. We can study these runic tablets to understand how our ancestors became masters of fire. Fire! Ah ha ha! But it's worn him out a bit. Kari will gather water and fill up those buckets rather easily, especially given the rain. And we'll put some more wood on the fire... soon. Moira will gather up seven fresh fruit, which is good, because everyone needs to eat. Brother Angelico will harvest healing plants. Oh, he did very well. Although he is running himself ragged. Eustace will continue to chop logs. I mean, basically, at the moment, he seems to be like dumb labor. That's a lot of strength. We should probably put him on something else soon. Just for times when other people are less capable of doing those tasks. So, Bladiaf works down the mine, gets us a bit of stone and iron. And let's see if. The now familiar hoofbeat of Erloff's mule can be heard in the distance. Here comes the human filth again. Oh no! If we could make it quick this time... Hello, hello my little piglets! Tribute time! <laughs> and over your precious resources to Uncle Erloff, eh? Hey! <laughs> Eric's just like giving him that death stare like, I'm gonna fucking kill you one of these days. <laughs> right. He hasn't asked for any extra yet. What's the eye for? Need at least, yep. 
If we give him extra without him asking, he's going to get bold and start making nasty demands. If we give less, that'll be tr too often, that'll be trouble. Now, Loki did inspire us to shortchange him last time. We gave him dirty water. And he's probably found out about that by now. So, I don't want to give him the extra wood, though. Because if I give him a 30, he'll be like, what about my cut? You've forgotten it? It's like, oh, mate, you didn't ask for it. So, yeah, we're, we're only going to give him what he's asking for. Here. Yeah. We don't want any trouble. There goes so much wood. Ah! <laughs> If you haven't understood yet that you are deeply in it, you're dumber than I thought. Thanks for your time, it has been a real pleasure, my little chicken. Next tribute from a Master Bjorn, praise be thy name, 30 fresh fruit, oh bugger. Bye bye, my little ponies. <laughs> yeah, we might just have to kill him next time. So, demands for fruit. Let's look at ways we can really work on that. Because that's currently our main source of food supplies. Let's fix this up. That's good. That's all done. We absolutely need to start working on this hunting lodge. Right now! It will be another way of gaining food, and it's a bit quicker than rearing the animals ourselves. Right, nobody's resting. Does anyone need to rest? I see a 61 here. Eustace, have the day off. Possibly Brother Angelico as well. Now, water, we will purify, and we will chuck a log on, and these are now much more effective. Right. Do we need you over here? No. Do we need to expand this to get a second person gathering? Absolutely. Mining. Um, if you just chop down trees for a little, that would be great. Okay. I think that's our afternoon sorted. Eustace gets to have a nice long rest, and he'll be back hard at work tomorrow, possibly even in the mine. Let's just work away on that hunting lodge. It might take a while, but yeah, with a little bit of luck and a little bit of help from his daughter, it should be ready by lunchtime tomorrow. Speaking of Kari, she gets to gather more water and feel miserable that she's been put to hard labour which she didn't really enjoy very much. Weather fills up water barrels a bit as well. Hey, and give us some clean water. Nice. Moira will get lots of fruit. Up to 11. Oh man, it's just going to be one fruit for everyone tonight as we try and get that. F we got a week. We got a week. We can probably do this. As long as we're careful. Speaking of being careful, however, Brother Angelico has once again overexerted himself and will be in great need of rest in the near future. Bloodyaf works chopping away at wood and gains a level, which we will attend to before the evening comes. Right about now, actually. Okay, hard hitter. Maximum damage plus two less critical chance, but one less action point. But one less action point is really bad. Sluggish Butcher. Minus 5 initiative. Effects resistance. Minus 20. That's... Okay, Blind Slayer. Oh, good God. Well, look, she just ain't gonna get sick very often, for now. <laughs> it's a shame, because some of those looked quite good. Bleeding and... Oh, my God. Right. Well...
let's make up some bandages. And you know what, because we have so much water, one of these as well. Right. Lady, you know what you need to do. Here's a bandage. You have injuries. Great. I don't know which one it was. Will it have updated? No, it won't, so I literally won't know. Let's head off to bed and see how things go from there. Right. Hey, wild girl. Yeah. Take this. You can have my share of food tonight. You look starving. Eh. I didn't ask for anything. She reminds me of someone. Can't help it. I saw God's teachings. We should break bread together and all that stuff. Your God's weird, mister. Drop the act. Everyone knows you're certainly not a true monk. You look nothing like a monk. Aha, and what makes you think that? Look at yourself. Nothing you told us adds up. I know that you're hiding something. Honestly, I don't give a shit. Just don't annoy me, okay? Oh, great. Now they're both upset at each other. 80s. Oh my god, he really needs a long rest tomorrow. Hunger is creeping up. Right. We have enough water for everyone, so let's just do that. And then we can address our food shortages. Right. One piece of fruit for everyone. And you as well. And you. Right. We got seven days to get 30 fruit. At five a day would be 35. We can afford one more for whoever is the most needy. Which is actually going to be him. But he gave her his share of the food tonight. We should absolutely keep that for an emergency. And then we all rest. And Brother Angelico gets to take half a day or a whole day off tomorrow because he is working himself to the bone. Injury 70! Oh my god, we need to do something about that. And a 61. Okay, who's good at healing apart from Moira? Because we really need to... Good God. Well, some food has gone rotten during the night. Oh! Yeah, that's... So, one rotten food? We need a compost heap. And the next day, the weather will be sunny once again. That's grand. Let's clean some water. Add to the firewood. You know what, we can even fix this a bit. Right, we don't need to be gathering water today, but hey! Hey, 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 I should end the episode here. Right, okay. We need to seriously stockpile fruit, which means we need to upgrade our fruit gathering resources very quickly. And that will be covered in the next episode. I hope you all enjoyed this one, and I'll see you all in the next one. I'll say bye-bye for now, and cheerio!